seven-year curse refers to the disbandment of a group once they've hit their seventh anniversary and that curse seems to be very real. Groups that had major success like 2NE1 and 4Minute ended up disbanding, shocking everyone. While the seven-year curse has definitely hit many groups there have been others that have survived. Despite not knowing the fates of groups like Girls Generation, Brown Eyed Girls, and FX, there have been other girl groups that have proven that anybody can beat the curse. These groups have definitely conquered their seventh year and are continuing to thrive in the entertainment industry. 1. A Pink A Pink made their debut on April 9, 2011, with their mini album Seven Springs of A Pink. Less than a year later, the group would have their first win on M Countdown with their song My My. A Pink has been pretty lucky with keeping their original lineup. The only member to leave the group was Yu Young, who left in 2013 to focus on her studies. Ad choice as advertising in red invented by teens through the years, A Pink has had some major success. Altogether, they've won over 30 music awards and over 30 music program awards. And most recently, they released the ridiculously amazing I'm So Sick, proving that they aren't going anywhere, too. Gabby and Jay the Ballad Trio made their debut in 2005 with their studio album The Very First. Originally composed of Hyman, P. Young, and Sif Hyun, the group would continue to change through the years. In 2009, Hyman became the first to leave the group and her spot would be filled by Misty. Then in 2011, P. Young announced her departure and the group would be a duo until 2012 when Misty left and Jenny and Gunji took over. The final change to the trio came in 2016 when the last original member, Sif Hyun, decided to leave when her contract expired and Sioran would step in to take her place. The trio also just had a new release three months ago showing that they're still a force to be reckoned with three. Davichi in 2008, Lee Harari and Kang Ming Kyung made their debut with I Love You Even Though I Hate You, and have never looked back. The powerful duo has released three studio albums, six EPs, and several soundtracks for well-known dramas like Descendants of the Sun and It's OK, That's Love. The duo's most recent album was released on January 25, 2018, and was a special album to celebrate their 10th anniversary. 9MUSES 9MUSES made their debut in March 2010 with an admissions and graduation concept but seven months later Jae Kyung would be the first to withdraw from the group to focus on her modeling career. Hyuna would take over and replace her. Two months later, the group would enter the Japanese market. Then in January the 2011, Binny, Rana, and Yuerin would leave the group without a replacement. Three months later Yuerin would rejoin the group. Around this time Star Empire announced they would be changing the group's name to Sweet Candy to avoid any confusion because the group only had seven members. Then a month later they would change their mind when they decided to introduce Kyung Ri and Sung Ah to the group. In 2014, Lee Sem, Yoon Ji, and Sara would graduate from the group and in 2015, So Yin and Ki Yoon Ho were added. In 2016, Minna, Yu Aaron, and Hyuna would graduate when their contracts expired. The same year 9MUSESA was formed with Kyung Ri, Hai Mi, So Yin, and Kim Ho. The four have continued as the subgroup of 9MUSES while Sung Ah is on a hiatus to pursue her work as a DJ. And the girls have continued to working hard. Their last release as a group was in August 2017, but Kyung Ri just released a solo song this month. 5. Girls Day Girls Day was formed in 2010 with Sol Yin, Mina, Yura, Hyeri, Jisun, Jin, and Jihee. The same year, Jisun and Jin would leave the group and two years later Jihee would follow them. Despite the departure of three of the girls within two years of debut, the group has had huge success. Songs like Darling, Ring My Bell, Something, and Expect have all sold over 1 million digital copies each. And the group was ranked 13th on Forbes' Career Power Celebrity list in 2015. Although the girls may not have put anything out recently, in March Yura confirmed that Girls' Day would be making a comeback sometime in 2018 so we all have that to look forward to. 6. Brave Girls Brave Girls have had a lot of ups and downs since their debut in 2011. The five-member group first released their single, The Difference, on April 7 and would continue promoting and releasing new music over the course of the year. Brave Girls had another successful comeback in 2012 and 2013 but would go on a two-and-a-half-year hiatus. 
When they made their return in 2016, it was announced that Yoon Young, COA, and Ye Jin would be leaving the group and that Yoon Ji, Hyun, Min Young, Yoo Jeng, and Yuna would be making their debut with the last two original members, Hi Aaron and Yo Jin. A year later, Yo Jin would depart from the group to focus on her education and study abroad while Hi Aaron went on an indefinite hiatus due to health concerns. The group had the last release in 2017, but have continued to perform at music shows and events. Here are all of the Show Me The Money 777 producers confirmed so far.